Hello and welcome all as we wait for the start of a match amongst the most anticipated fixtures over the course of the entire season. A day certainly not for the faint-hearted. It is yet another edition of this long-standing conflict between two sides engaged in a never-ending rivalry. One that never has and never will lose its intensity no matter what the context, no matter how many times these two clubs meet. The match day boys at this place is truly special. The pride, the passion adds to a massive sense of occasion. Jim, this one always matters. Well, we never really did friendly derbies, not when I was playing Peter. But it, it's impossible to keep rivalries in check, completely in check. So while I'm not expecting everything to go flying at 100 miles an hour, this could get spicy. is pivotal well this guy Donnarumma is someone who's been predestined for for greatness Peter and he hasn't disappointed immense in terms of shot stopping we know that but I think his distribution has also improved and it needed to although he likes to keep it quite safe and simple yes he'd be my pick too it's going to be all about how they get the best out of him Chance to counter. And there's green grass ahead of him. He is through here. A lot of space ahead of him. Gabriel can get it clear. Turns back here, probably the best option. Colwell. Spread out to the left. Cleared without complication. Gets it back. Rice producing a good steal there. Showing a good level of alertness. And he cuts out the supply. And back to the keeper they go. Kukurea. It's not the game we were hoping for, Peter. I think both of these keepers could text about their respective uninvolvement. Sterling. Sterling. There's the shot! Now, who's going to be first to this? And he's there to get it away. And nicely intercepted. Oh, the runner's been sold a little bit short there. Ah, quality deserted them when they really needed it. Martinelli. Zinchenko. Well, you can see what, what they're trying to do here, Peter. You know, get the ball into wider areas. Yeah, there is a, a very visible, a very, a very definite pattern here. Well, that's where the space is, and it's quite simple. It's just going to stretch. Gabriel Jesus! Challenge just a bit on the firm side. Really has the confidence and skill to be able to hold the ball up like that until support arrives a little sooner. And just maybe there. Has a goal! Oh! Oh! 
simplicity itself. Well, look, he moves and manufactures in unique fashion. This guy is sheer class. It's 1-0. Oh, just listen to the reaction. I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. Gabriel Jesus. Delicate ball, and it needs to be. Well read. And the danger is averted. He's found a way through. Oh, the referee's booking him here for a dive. Listen, he can play the innocent as much as he wants, Peter, but it was fairly obvious to everyone here. He's got no hiding place. Martinelli has got the wrong side of the referee and got himself a yellow card for his troubles. He's having a go! And that's caused the worry or two. Well, he doesn't need a second invitation, even from that range. Havertz, over to the left. He's shifting through the gears here. Well time, excellent interception. Rice. Reds one in, and that has left him in a heap. And that is going to be the final action of the first half. So the end of the first half, both teams have had their moments. There's been no shortage of talking points, but there has been just one goal. And that is the state of it at the break. 1-0. Well, that certainly pleased the fans, and the players are definitely happy with that scoreline. The question is now, can they protect it? Leading 1-0 at the break. And we're already back underway here. A solitary goal. That has been the crucial... Oh, great header! Great effort. He flew in with courage. And no complaints about his effort and commitment. He just needs to start heading in the right direction to get the drift. Rice wins the duel this time. Nicked it back promptly. Out to the left it goes. Gallagher. And that's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. Well, that's the first attempt, Peter, we've seen at one of those breaking passes just to spread the play. Saka. Now it's Odegaard. Forwards and with intent. Well, that is one way to stop him. Odegaard. Saka. Aimed into a massive lead. Good delivery, but no joy. Gabriel Jesus really isn't happy with himself after that, having done so well to get on the end of it too. A couple of changes then in quick succession. Gets his pass away. That has been cut short. Hoisted upfield by the keeper. Colwell. There's a sharp little ball here. He's onside. That's what has to be done now, no question about it. There is an irresistible, irrepressible look about them here. 
you know, the interest value in this game might just take off from here. Cole Will. Third guard. Looking for options for movement. Unketia. He might. It's Unketia! No mistake! And with the match slipping away, they have hauled themselves off the canvas. And very quickly, the substitute made his mark. I think the manager's claiming an assist here. Hostel grab the equaliser and we're all square. Yeah, it's a very good contest with two very good sides and with such great individual talent on show, it could go either way. Fiddles it through. Don't you just love the level of intensity here? Neither is prepared to back down and, and to be honest, that's how it should be. Well played right into his path. And the shot! Arsenal! And the comeback is complete! We knew what was coming, and he has outfoxed the keeper again. Well, how's that for composure, Peter? You can see the keeper tried to put as much pressure on him by staying upright, but it didn't phase him, not in the slightest. Two goals on the day, and he may not yet be done. Hostel take the lead. Well, that's really winded the opposition. You can see their manager screaming on the touchline, telling his team to calm down. But they'll need to do that pretty quickly. It's composure from here. Gallagher. He can get that clear. I thought it was going to happen then. How many more chances can they realistically expect now? Oh, good spread. Yeah, this kind of bold running will always get you into areas of possibility. Well, from experience, I can tell you he'll get a lot of stick for getting that one wrong. And it's Jorginho. Four added minutes on the board. I think that's offside. Yes, it is. Not too much added time is up and there goes the whistle